Yo Berhausen, I have another awesome product to review. This is the Warhammer 40k Chaos Decimator Demon Engine from Forgeworld. As you can see, this is a full model and it has many parts to it. I will open the bag and show you all the pieces up close. I'll start by showing you the instruction manual. Well, it's not really a manual as it only has two pages. <laughs> Anywho, this is what the finished model should look like. As you may have noticed, it doesn't have any weapons, because you have to buy them separately, but I will show you the ones I will be using in a later video. Now, I'll turn it round, open it up, and show you the first page. Here, it says Imperial Armour, and it has a list of the different parts that you get in the bag. On the back it has step-by-step -step instructions on how to build the model and these are continued on to a second page. Okay, I'll open up the bag again and show you the parts. This is of course the base. Same size as a dreadnought base, 60mm. For the first piece, uh, yeah I think I'll show you the biggest one. This is the main body of the demon engine and it has this very cool looking pipework snaking all around the piece. This detail is a hatch that has been chained shut to contain the demon within. Next piece I'll show you... yeah one of the huge shoulder pads. As you can see it has these nice raised details and it is segmented into three sections. I'll now get the second one for you to see. Here it is. It has more raised edges and these are in the shape of the Chaos Star symbol. Next piece. Or pieces as I should say. As these are the three exhaust pipes that you get. These go on top of the model and have a very worn look to them. Next we have these here and I think these yeah these are the demon engines upper legs or thighs the right one has a chaos arrow and the left one has a skull and now we have if I can find them <laughs> we have these and these are the shins. They're quite simple and they have more of those cool pipes. And I'll get both of the lower legs out. This one has more raised chaos arrows on it. And the other one, get it in shot there, the other one is pretty much the same. Right, now we have these two small pieces. They are the weapon mounts, and like I said before, I'll show you the weapons in due course. Next up is two even smaller pieces, the knees. The right one has a row of teeth on it, and the left one is pretty plain. Now I shall show you the arms. You get two of them, obviously, <laughs> and these have ball joints. The one I'm holding on the left has an eight-pointed chaos star symbol, and the right one has a mutated looking face. Another ball jointed part is this. It is the engine's hips. It has a grill on it, if you can see that there. The penultimate sprue has the feet. You actually get three of them, and the middle one is bent slightly. This is so you can pose the model how you like. The final part, you'll have probably guessed, is the face. I will get that up close for you to have a look at. This is a really great kit. The resin is high quality and I found no miscasts here. The pieces are very finely detailed, and I cannot wait to build the model now. 
I have a few conversions lined up for him. Uh, I'll go ahead and pack the bits back up and I will see you guys in a later video where I will show you the model fully built and converted. I'll also show you the weapons before I add them to it. Ooh, I seem to have dropped a piece on the floor. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> this is the Warhammer 40k Decimator Demon Engine from Forge World. Hope you like it.